and stop. If you haven't seen this movie, turn off this video, go watch it right now. I don't care what time it is or when you're watching this video. Stop whatever you're doing and go see this movie. So, Selma stars David Oyelowo, Oprah Winfrey, and Cuba Gooding Jr., amongst a bunch of other talented actors. Now, this film is fantastic. I'm going to tell you guys right off the bat, this is a movie you cannot miss. You're doing a disservice to yourself and the entire movie industry if you do not see this movie. It's seriously amazing. Now, if you haven't seen this movie and you don't know what it's about, basically this movie is about Martin Luther King and the Civil Rights Movement, specifically the march from Selma to Washington. Now, David Oyelowo's performance of Martin Luther King Jr. is one of the best performances I have ever seen in a film. I'm not lying to you when I say that. Seriously, for about half of this movie, I believed that Martin Luther King was resurrected from the dead and put onto the big screen. That's how believable Oyelowo's performance was in this film. It was fantastic. I'm going to be seriously pissed off if he is not at least nominated for an Oscar this year. Now, if I haven't stressed this enough of how good of a performance he gave, let's put it this way. All the other actors and actresses in this film did an amazing job, and he blew them all out of the water. That's how great of a job he did in this movie. Now, along with the performances which were amazing in this movie, the film looked fantastic. The director, along with the cinematographer, did a great job of making the movie look great. Honestly, there were some scenes in this movie that sent chills down my spine. They were incredibly hard to watch, but I couldn't keep my eyes off the screen. They were so intense and so well directed that I didn't feel like I was watching a movie, but watching it happen in real life. And since this is a movie based on true events, you really felt that while watching the movie. You know, watching it was really hard to understand that, you know, this stuff really did happen. And it's a shame that it did. Now, I don't want to sound too bold saying this, but this isn't just one of the best movies I've seen this year or even last year. This is one of the best movies that I've seen in the last five years. I'm not overselling this or exaggerating. This film is fantastic. It does what it does better than any movie I've ever seen. Out of all the true story films that I've seen in the last few months, this is probably the best one. Now, I'm not trying to over-exaggerate or oversell this movie too much, but this may be one of the best movies I've seen in the last five years. I am truly telling you that from the bottom of my heart that you should go see this movie as soon as possible. You're doing a huge disservice, as I previously said, by not seeing this movie. It's, it's just, it's great. I'm lost for words right now. Usually I try to edit this and do some things to make it sound more official, but I'm lost for words to try to get the point across of how amazing this movie was. It is worth the full price of the ticket. You definitely get your money's worth with this. It's one of those movies that you leave the theater and you're just silent for a few minutes after because you really take in what the movie says and the message that I sent across. This movie should be shown in every history class across the country. Seriously. Teachers, if you are having a hard time getting your students interested in the civil rights and Martin Luther King Jr., show this movie to them. They will be interested and invested in the whole movement and you will have their eye for the rest of the class. Now perhaps my favorite thing about this movie is the fact that it shows how much of a struggle Martin Luther King truly had. In history class, all you learn about is how much of a deep impact he had on the civil rights movement, and all you see is the great speeches he gave, and that's about it. And those are great, but you never really get to see how much of a struggle he truly had. This film portrays that perfectly. It shows that there are times in the civil rights movement that his faith wavered. He didn't always think that they were going to win. There was times when he was just as curious as every other African-American citizen about whether or not they would get their rights that they deserved. Now this movie is going to get a 10 out of 11 for me. It is an amazing film and you are doing a huge disservice to yourself if you do not go see it. See it as soon as possible and if you can't see it in the theater, which I strongly recommend, as soon as it comes out on DVD and Blu-ray, go watch it. It is fantastic. It is probably one of the best films of this decade, and I hope that you guys can see it. Well, I'm the Casual Movie Guy, and I'm out.